This rally was supposed to happen last week, but President Robert Mugabe had to go to Singapore for a routine medical checkup, the third one this year. Zimbabwe's leader says he's back with energy, and if anyone thinks he's going to step down because of his age and health, they are wrong. He thanked the youth for always standing by him. No backbiting, no factions, and no desire at the moment to be successors. When the president is still there. Zimbabwe's president is 93 years old. He has ruled Zimbabwe since independence from Britain in 1980. Oh, President Mugabe insists he's fit enough unity, to campaign and that he will win next year's election. 19, but some political analysts are skeptical. They speculation Mugabe so could call for an early election because of concerns about his health. Some people are also concerned about infighting in the ruling Zanu PF party over succession. We know that Zanu-PF has always had factions, even during the years of the armed struggle. But it has never degenerated to this level of naked uh, and very, very, very open uh, antagonism and hostility. So it actually, uh, you know, we, we, we are worried that it could actually, if not properly handled, degenerate into a national security crisis. Because, look, both factions have access to arms of war. The president's main rival, Morgan Tsangirai, is also back in the country from a medical trip. He says he may form a coalition with other opposition leaders to challenge Mugabe next year. Attempts over the years by Tsangirai's MDC Tea Party to remove Mugabe from office have failed. Zimbabwe's leader says he's not going anywhere. He insists he's been in power for nearly four decades because his people love him. And his black economic empowerment policies. Harumutasa, Al Jazeera, Lupane, Zimbabwe.